We're going to create active this morning. There's a few things you can't find that are really important. One, before we get this guy's legs or pull him down, i gotta, I got to move the guy. All right? And I'm moving with my hands and my feet at the same time. I can't just grab this guy and think, I move. a lot of times people do is they, think they plant their feet and they try and swing this guy around. It happens a lot. Well, not only is he going to be really tired, but I'm probably not going to swing the guy around. And most likely, he's just going to dive in on my legs. Maybe dive in or not. <laughs> on my leg. But also, same thing being said, if I try to move him with just my feet, not my hands, he's not going to go anywhere. So I got to put both of them together. So when I'm in this session, or any time you're thinking about when the whistle blows, I know I have a game plan. If I shake into this guy, I know I'm going to put my hands on him. I'm going to move my feet, I'm going to pull him down, so I get in that position, get to react, my shots, pull him down, turn my ankle pick, whatever it's going to be, it all comes from moving this guy with my hands and my feet. Right? So what I want you guys to do now is to make contact with the guy. We make contact, we don't just reach the guy. So if you reach, what's he going to do? Shoot. So we got to make contact two ways. One, we're going to take our, our palm of our hand, put his forehead. Now we know where he's going. If he changes levels, Change the levels with them. You got your hand off. Go right back to it. Get to our collar tie. So for us, right now, I like right hand collar tie, left hand inside tie. Pretty simple. Right hand collar tie, left hand inside tie. I like to be at right. I like to come with his tricep, partner, the good partner. Grab my elbows. We don't want a limp partner when you start moving this guy. We don't want to move a limp partner when the guy does this. That doesn't do either of us any good. So when I grab this guy, he grabs it back. Now all I want to do is we're going to pull him down and I'm going to pull him to his hands. So I'm going to move my feet, I think about pulling this guy down to his hands. It's not a snap, I'm not doing this. I'm trying to snap the guy down. It's constant pull. It's constant. So as I'm moving, I'm just pulling. I'm constantly moving my feet to pull this guy's head down. Always looking for an angle on him. So I think I want to make contact. Either with our, our palm and his forehead, close distance. Collar tie, we'll make contact with our head first, head to head, collar tie. Also, when I go to my collar tie, I'm not reaching my elbow out. If I reach my elbow out, what you do is shoot on me. My elbow to the mat. It's my first line of defense. Also, when I get my collar tie, my elbow to the mat, he shoots on me, stop my elbow first. So, elbow to the mat, collar tie, inside tie. As I move this guy, I'm trying to pull him to his hands. It's constant pull, so I'm not doing this. I'm trying to jump, jump around. I'm moving my feet and pull him down. I think I'm pulling this guy to his hands. I pull his hands three times. I'm trying to pull him to his hands, come back up, pull him to his hands, pull him to his hands. Every time I pull, I'm going to circle my feet. Yeah? I'll just do it. One, two, three.